angel over you who will stop you from backbiting. And when you go away from a gathering, say the same words and the angel will stop other people from backbiting against you. Alhamdulillah. Such a beautiful saying of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. If we can all act upon this, inshallah, no doubt, we will be beneficial in this world and in the hereafter. Sallu ala al-Habib Sallallahu ta'ala ala Muhammad Wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa barik wa sallim Nigran Shura Haji Muhammad Imran al-Tari Maddazilur Ali In one of his bayan He mentions a very very faith enlightening story He says that Sayyiduna Junaid Baghdadi Rahmatullahi ta'ala alayhi before he was given walayat, before he became a waliullah, Junaid Baghdadi Rahmatullah was one of the famous wrestlers in Baghdad Sharif. He had a very big body and he was very, very strong. One day, Sayyidina Junaid Baghdadi Rahmatullah, his opponent was a young, weak and skinny person. Very, very weak. And he was never a match to Junaid Baghdadi Rahmatullahi Ta'ala And before the fight was about to start, this young man, he went up to Junaid Baghdadi Rahmatullahi Ali and he says that, Oh Junaid, I know you are very strong and maybe you can win this fight within a few seconds. But I have something to say to you. And this young man, he started saying to Junaid Baghdadi Rahmatullahi before the fight even started, he says that I am a Sayyid and I am a traveler. And it has been days that me and my family and my children have had, have not had a proper meal to eat. I would request you and I would urge you that please have mercy on us. And let me win this fight so that whatever prize money we get, I can go home and feed my family. And he says that, oh, Junaid, in return, I promise you, on the day of judgment, I will ask my grandfather to intercede for you and to put a crown over your head. Junaid Baghdadi, when he heard these words of that Sayyid, his heart became emotional. And... Within a few seconds, he deliberately lost the fight. And all that prize money was given to that young man who happily went home. Sayyidina Junaid Baghdadi, Rahmatullah when he went home, all day long, he's been thinking to himself. Because those words of that Sayyid were echoing in his mind. That night when he went to sleep, his destiny awoke. Allah. And he saw the beautiful Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam in his dream. And he says, Oh Junaid, you had mercy, you had that dignity and respect from my grandson, for my family. I promise you, I will give you respect, I will give you dignity in this world and in the hereafter. Allah. And I will give you that respect. And therefore, I am making you the leader of the saints, the leader of the awliya kiram of your time. Junaid Baghdadi, rahmatullahi, when he woke up in the morning, he was amazed to see that there were thousands of ulama kiram and awliya kiram who were stood outside with their hands fastened, with their heads bowed down with respect. 